What is the maximum altitude any fighter jet can reach, and why can't it go further up? Fighter jets are impressive machines designed to fly at high speeds and altitudes while performing advanced maneuvers. However, every aircraft has its limits, including the maximum altitude that it can reach. The maximum altitude that any fighter jet can reach varies depending on the type of aircraft, but it typically ranges from 50,000 to 60,000 feet. This height is known as the service ceiling, which is defined as the maximum altitude an aircraft can reach while maintaining a steady rate of climb of 100 feet per minute. The reason why fighter jets can't go further up is due to the thinning of the air at higher altitudes. As an aircraft climbs, the air pressure decreases, making it harder for the engines to produce the necessary thrust to keep the plane flying. Additionally, the air becomes less dense, which reduces the lift generated by the wings, making it difficult to maintain altitude. Another factor limiting the altitude of fighter jets is the human body's ability to tolerate high altitudes. At extreme heights, the lack of oxygen and low air pressure can cause altitude sickness, hypoxia, and other health complications for the pilot. Moreover, the service ceiling of an aircraft is not only affected by the engine's power but also by the aircraft's weight and design. A heavier aircraft or one with less powerful engines will have a lower service ceiling than a lighter and more powerful one. So the maximum altitude that any fighter jet can reach is determined by several factors, including engine power, aircraft weight, and design, as well as the human body's physiological limits. While fighter jets are capable of flying at high altitudes, they have limits, and going any further up can be both technically and physiologically challenging.